Let's see if we can sneak another one in before the first half comes to a close. Get to the outsides. There we go. Oh, no. Not like that. Not like that. Guys, welcome back to a brand new Madden 20 Ultimate Team episode. Let's not waste any time and jump right into this. There's a lot to cover in this episode, man. But first things first, you guys know how I like to start things off by taking a look at not only our offense. Here is our amazing defense on the last episode, which if you missed... There's a link in the description to the full playlist. We got not only Brian Burns, we upgraded Ryan Shazier to 99. We also got Lawrence Taylor. This team is amazing. I got a lot planned for you guys today, but before we do anything, let's try to reach 6,000 likes on this episode. The more you guys smash that thumbs up button, the more it will help me out. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Also follow my Twitter and Instagram. I'm gonna be doing giveaways this weekend, so make sure you're following my social media. Just to remind you, we are one win away from from going to the playoffs so hopefully we could get this done today i noticed brand new packs in the store it's called fan appreciation packs now i'm kind of confused here but then i started reading about it it says you get one 86 plus overall draft player 186 plus overall ultimate legend player and then it also comes with a 186 plus overall elite player you could buy five individual ones and then you could also get two bundles which contains five packs each. So in total, we're gonna have 15 fan appreciation packs. My thing is this, if there's gonna be fan appreciation packs that cost money, like imagine paying for something that's like an appreciation for you. Anyways, if I'm gonna pay for packs that are supposed to appreciate me, I better get a golden ticket. I'm gonna say it right here, right now. AP is one of the newest ones they dropped. Of course, you guys know Brian Burns. And then there's also a brand new Mohamed Sanu. Now, I'm not sure if the older golden tickets are still in packs, but I want one golden ticket out of this fan appreciation pack opening. We all know what the plan is today, man. We're trying to pull another golden ticket with fan appreciation packs. But first, I'm gonna go ahead and spend 500 of my Madden points on these weekly elite fantasy packs. In my last video, when I opened this up, I did get a 97 draft player. So let's see if we could get it going here. That's an Easter. That's an Easter pool, 96, Robert Woods. And then we get a quick sell of T-Sizzle. That's an 80 overall. That's not going to go for much. I got just a little over 17,000 Madden points. What I'm going to do is I'm going to buy the two bundles that we are guaranteed with. You can't get any more than this. So with the two bundles, we're going to have 10. We will open up these 10 packs in just a few seconds. First, I'm going to go ahead and do the individual ones. We're only limited to five. So let's see how this is going to go. Let's see how this is going to go. Like I said, we're either going to completely flop. As you see right here, like that's not good. Full X is what we want. A full Ultimate Legend is what we want. 96 isn't bad. And it is an 86 Elite. We get ourselves at 94. See, this right here is a W. I need to feel appreciated. Come on. Give me a golden ticket. Oh, there we go. There we go. 97, Walter P. And then we get a heavyweight, 88, and then an 86. See, these cost 50,000 coins, and we just made our money back, right? Here we go. The final fan appreciation pack. Oh, wow. We get Odell. Full X. Give me a full. Oh, man. If we only got a full there, that would have been a sick pack. Look at all these different pulls. Oh, man. We can't buy any more individual packs. The only fan appreciation packs that I have now are the two bundles that I got in the store. So we got 10 of them. Wish your boy some luck. Let's try to clutch out something amazing. We got the cameras on. We got the cameras on. What is this? Dude, we're halfway there. Five more. Anything. But a golden ticket is a bust. Come on. Whoa! Whoa! We get a 99! Gets in there! Dude, I did not think this was possible. We got a 99 overall pull out of a fan appreciation pack. I feel appreciated. We got two more to go, boys. Man, this has been honestly pretty clutch. I would say we came out with a lot of gems. Look at this right here, 97 and a 93. We're about to go ahead and make some changes to the team. Now, unfortunately, the first move of the day is going to hurt my soul. It really is. But we're going to be releasing Lamar Jackson. I got a comment from Sergio Martinez. He said, pick up Sanu. I want to see funny gameplay with him. Love the vids, man. The cheapest mom at Sanu up is going for 1.5, you guys. Oh, someone just had to ruin my moment, huh? Someone just had to buy him. 
The cheapest one up, 1.51 mil. We're gonna do this over. You guys see his stats right there, man. Let's not waste any time and buy him. Mohamed Sanu is now our starting quarterback, and that's gonna be the only move on offense today. Now, for his X Factors, I give him Bazooka, Protected, Escape Artist, Dashing Deadeye, and Evasive. As far as the defense goes, I'm making one move, and that is at the defensive tackle spot. I will be releasing Warren Sapp. I did get a comment from Amori. He said, hey, you should pick up the 98 John Randall. He's really fast and will be able to get sacks fast. Pause, my boy. Surprisingly, John Randall is only going for 176,000 coins. We're going to go ahead and pick him up, and he's going to become 99 overall after I power him up. After powering him up, he became 99 overall, and that's going to be the final move of the day. If there's anyone else you guys want to see for the next episode, be sure to comment down below and let me know who I should bring in, and you could be featured on that episode. One win away from the playoffs, no pressure. Let's go ahead and jump right into this. Hopefully, Mohamed Sanu's debut goes as smooth as possible, and we could clinch a playoff spot. It's time to see the top three. He has Randall Cunningham, Barry Sanders, and Clowney. And it goes our top three. It's not about what cards you have on your team. It's about how you use them. It's about how you play with them. Look at that beautiful throw. We're going to be just a little short. Wide open. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Big first down. Fresh new downs here. Sanu. Oh, we're taking off. No. What just happened? What just happened? What just happened? I'm gonna try out this read option play. Hopefully he bites. He does have Lawrence Taylor. He hasn't been biting with Lawrence. But there goes AP. There goes AP. One man to beat. Let's see Sanu's accuracy. Oh God. Oh God. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No! Not again, bro. Not again. I try to get a highlight clip. I mean, you just absolutely hate to see it. I don't know what else I could say. Third and 12. Give me that, boy. Give me that. Let's go. Let's go. That's how you redeem yourself. We're right back at it with Mohamed Sanu. AP! There we go. The game is now tied up. Here comes his next possession now. Earlier, he had nothing going his way. So let's see what he's going to do here. Sending blitz. Give me that. Give me that. Ooh, he took the bait. He took the bait. I think for me to get a really nice Mohamed Sanu gameplay, I'm going to have to switch up my offensive playbook. Because right here, I only have, I have Seattle's. And this doesn't really have a lot of like running plays with quarterbacks. It has a lot of read options. But I want like quarterback blasts, all that good stuff. But for now, forget about a playbook. Good guy AP is going off. He is all the way at the one yard line. Third and goal. Let's see if he's going to close out this drive with a touchdown. And of course, they give it to him. To start off the second half, he does have the ball here first. So let's see what he's going to try to do. He does have a... How is that not picked off? I seriously need to get a stop here. And he keeps running the same play. Thank you. Thank you. All the way. Dude, he has ran the same run all game long. Yes. I'll do the same thing. Quit. Dismiss yourself. Just like that, we are officially in the playoffs. I didn't play that well in the last game, but hopefully on the next one, we can get it going with Sanu. Let's not waste any time and jump into the wild card round. For the first game of the playoffs, I did switch to the Arizona Cardinals playbook because they have a lot of like jet sweep plays, a lot of crazy different plays for quarterback runs. So we should be able to see a lot more from Sanu this game. Dude, how crazy is this? We just got match made against someone who's in their Super Bowl. This game feels extra choppy right now. Oh, he's going with a screen? On the first play? I hope this is going to be a good game, man. Second and 15. Stewart. Oh, no, he didn't. Why would you do that? I really hope this play works out for us, man. The fake jet sweep is going to be ran by Mohamed Sanu, obviously. Hopefully, we could go straight to the house. Block for me. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. There he goes. Very curious to see what he's going to do with his next drive. He throws a pick here. 
Oh no, this guy's gonna be quitting soon, I feel like. Third and 10 here. I feel like we should have Randy open. He was, he was, wasn't he? It's all good. We got another man open. It's Jerry Rice. Sanu, let's try to get the second touchdown. Oh my goodness. Untouched. Muhammad Sanu. I'm just gonna throw a wild guess that this is gonna be the last possession. Denied. Just a wild guess. Oh my lord. Lawrence Taylor. I thought I was a safety. Gonna go with a man to man coverage here. Needs to get rid of it quickly, bro. You can't be running around the pocket like that. Chase Young with the sack. We're gonna go ahead and continue the Michael Sanu show. We're taking off. Oh, that's an easy first. That's an easy first. Let's see if we can sneak another one in before the first half comes so close. Get to the outsides. There we go. Oh, no. Not like that. Not like that. Mohamed Sunu with touchdown number three. That one was special, though. That was nice. We're at the two-minute mark. He's all the way at the 27. Looking to go up on the scoreboard for the first time today. I'm cool with giving up anything but seven points here. Third down. Oh, he's scrambling out. Down he goes. Miles Garrett with the sack. So now a big fourth down coming up. And he is going to settle with a field goal. So he's playing the long game. And it looks like he is not going to be quitting anytime soon. Hold up. Boy. The disrespect. He really tried to sneak in. A touchdown there. Now we got to go for the game finisher. We got 56 seconds remaining here. Sanu. Oh, there we go. Of course, he doesn't hang on to it. And of course, that happened. I guess I got to go for possession catch every time. The mistakes I'm making are just so low IQ. I can't believe it. Give me that boy. We get it right back. We get it right back. This man, Ryan Shazier. Hold up. We're going to celebrate early. Oh, man. I try to, I try to dance around him. But let's get one more in before the first half comes to an end. Who do I have? Who do I have? Dump it off. To our running back. He's going with a strip. Man, can we just go into the locker rooms? This dude is actually stripping my players. What kind of a grown man strips another grown man? This half has already been bizarre enough, but let's see how it's going to come to an end. He's going to get rid of it, and this is going to get picked off. Hopefully, it does by that boy Calvin, and I don't know what that was. I guess he kneeled it. We are going to be up 23 to nothing. I really want to be able to get a passing touchdown with Sanu as well. I don't want to just do it on the ground. What is happening? This guy is the ultimate stripper. Now he just pissed me off. Like, now I'm pissed. I'm going to do that when I'm pissed. What are you doing, sir? Are you swatting fly? What are you doing with your player? Let's go. Oh my goodness. Back to back? You know what? I'm going to run backwards. I'm going to run backwards. I want Sanu to get these touchdowns. I got one goal, and that is to pad on Sanu stats here. Wait a second. Wait a second. Oh, he caught it. Evan Ingram. Finally, we get one for Sanu through the air. And just like that, this guy is going to be quitting in his Super Bowl. Can't blame him. 36 to nothing. We are officially in the conference championship game. We'll go ahead and continue our playoff journey on the next episode. If you guys enjoyed this episode, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Make sure you comment down below. Let me know who we should bring in for the next episode. And you could be featured on that episode. Continue being amazing people. It's your boy, Onto the Boss. I'm signing out.